Mount Fuji, a world-renowned beauty of Japan. Located at the foot of Mount Fuji is Yamanashi Prefecture. Yamanashi, rich in nature, is Japan's leading fruit-growing region and is also focusing on new initiatives that incorporate world-class carbon reduction. Introducing the Four Per Thousand initiative of Yamanashi, where the gentle breeze blows and we always picture the smiling faces of those who eat our fruits. The future, aiming for a sustainable society and going beyond deliciousness. Yamanashi Prefecture is located almost in the center of Japan. This area, rich in nature and home to the Mount Fuji World Heritage Site, brings various blessings including pure water and crisp air. Yamanashi Prefecture features long sunshine hours throughout the year. There is also a large difference in temperature between day and night and little rainfall making it an ideal place for growing fruit. Fruit production flourishes here, giving Yamanashi the name of Fruit Kingdom. Yamanashi boasts the highest production of grapes, peaches, and plums in Japan. We also harvest other fruits throughout the year, including strawberries, cherries, and blueberries. Many people come here for our fresh fruit. In recent years, our fruit has been exported overseas, becoming widely known for its delicious taste and high quality. The fruit kingdom of Yamanashi was possible not only due to its natural conditions, but also due to our improved fruit varieties, technological development, and reduced use of chemical fertilizers and pesticides, resulting in stable production and quality that pleases consumers. It is for these reasons that we also proactively take on the challenge of global environmental issues, in addition to agricultural production. That's how the 4 per thousand initiative began. A fruit farmer in Fuefuki City who grows peaches and grapes. After cultivation, the pruned branches are made into charcoal. The pruned branches store carbon through plant photosynthesis. If burnt, it becomes carbon dioxide, which is released into the atmosphere. However, when turned into charcoal and spread over the fields, the carbon can be retained in the soil long term. This is the work of the 4 per thousand initiative. The idea is that if the amount of carbon in the top 30 centimeters of the world's soil is increased by 0.4% per year, then the carbon dioxide caused by the human economy can be offset virtually zero. Many countries and international organizations, including Japan, are participating in this initiative. In April 2020, Yamanashi Prefecture became the first local government in Japan to participate. At the fifth Four Per Thousand Initiative Day, held in Scotland in conjunction with COP26 in 2021, Yamanashi was invited as the only participant from Japan and gave a speech remotely. We are engaging in the Four Per Thousand initiative because we do not want to continue to deteriorate the environment in the area where we live. We want our consumers to feel that our food tastes better than what they usually eat, so they want to eat it again, and we want them to smile. Japan produces not only sake and whiskey, but also wine. Yamanashi Prefecture, in particular, is actively engaging in the 4 per thousand initiative. There are many wines made with Japan's unique grape varieties, such as Koshu and Muscat Berry A. Please come and try this. This process is born in French and now it's applied in Japan. I started applying Yamanashi around April 2020 and it's a very interesting 
uh, project because if we think about the agriculture, agriculture covers around 40% of the surface of the earth. So if we think about the quantity of carbon that can be consent to trap in the soil with this project can be very important for the climate change. So I think it's very important that agriculture apply with this project. So. I think this is a great occasion for viticulture to demonstrate their contribute to reduce the global warming and Japan with this occasion can be an example all over the world. Preventing global warming is an issue for all humankind and it cannot be solved unless we all work together. We hope to contribute to the prevention of global warming by promoting the 4 per thousand initiative through grape cultivation. We are cultivating grass as part of the 4 per thousand initiative. Grass cultivation involves mowing and leaving behind weeds that grow in the field, allowing the weeds to absorb carbon dioxide from the air and store the carbon, which can be retained in the soil. Using compost that contains organic matter can trap carbon in the soil. Furthermore, by storing carbon dioxide from the air as carbon, pruned branches can be turned into charcoal and put into the soil, allowing carbon to be stored for a long period of time. We are confident that by delivering high-quality wine, we will be able to bring smiles to everyone's faces. Carbon can be stored in soil through residue plowing, which involves the plowing in and post-harvest sweet corn stalks and rice straw from rice cultivation into fields. In 2021, we established the Yamanashi 4 per thousand initiative agricultural product certification system, the first in Japan which certifies agricultural products produced through the efforts of the 4 per thousand initiative. Yamanashi 4 per thousand initiative agricultural products are certified after a strict process. It's products like these which are the pride and brand of the fruit kingdom of Yamanashi. This logo certifies agricultural products and restaurants using these products. In addition to helping solve climate change, the efforts of the Yamanashi 4 per thousand initiative are expected to produce various benefits such as providing a stable food supply and the creation of disaster-resistant soil. Yamanashi, where the cherry blossoms bloom vigorously, working hard together and refining production technology with beauty and sincerity. Providing one-of-a-kind deliciousness that can only be found here offering our products to as many people in the world as possible through unremitting efforts. Aiming for a sustainable society and going beyond deliciousness towards a delicious future, Yamanashi.